Welcome back everyone to Kaiser Redux, I'm your host, Mr. Mocha Lover. And right now, this is not where we left off last time. No, I've actually basically sort of redid the last episode off screen just because I didn't like, as we all know, hopefully, the, from the end of last episode, we we had a little bit of a naval disaster. I lost 79 destroyers in a single um, d battle. Like, I was like, wow, I, I gotta go back and fix this. This isn't, this isn't very good. But let's go through some focuses first. Um, like normal, I did Fortress uh, Britain, which is cool. I did Blood, Toil, Tears, and Sweat as well, but never was so much owed by so many, uh, to so, many, so few. The inspiring actions of our forces will help pull the union together, and we're doing victory on the home front for better consumer goods. We beat the capitalists in the factories. Who would have thought? And we'll probably do total mobilizations really nice. I like that one a lot. But Bl Bletchley Park? Damocles Project, of course. Statistical Warfare. That stuff is all nice. Um, I honestly don't remember if we did anything else here yet. Like... We got the rail reform, obviously. We've got the industrial veteran program. Um, I did Central Command as well, which I think I already read it last time. People's Officer Corps would be very nice, actually. We lose some political power, which is totally fine with us, even though we could use some more army XP. And I did finish up Dickens' plan as well. So, yeah, we're still we're still going down that way. Uh, it is 1940. That would be pretty good to do. Our public Air Force would be really nice to do as well, even though we don't need that air XP, realistically. We might grab that a little bit later, but since we're at war, let's do People's Officer Corps next. Officers have a duty, and that is to be loyal to the revolution by establishing a centralized... People's Officer Corps and ending the terrible practice of military units voting for their leaders, we can make sure they fill, fill that duty. Cool. And some comments to go through. And actually, right now on screen, as you can see, that was like my favorite comment from yesterday. Like, <laughs> I really screwed up my Navy in that last episode. Um, but like I said, I did redo things. And actually, it's been a lot better. Um, actually, at the beginning of last episode, I started making carriers. Well, like I said, I went back and replayed it. This time, I didn't make carriers. I made more b battleships and dreadnoughts and stuff like that, so... Uh, let's see. Can we actually see the loss? This is equipment in the field. 24 heavies, cruisers, destroyers, carriers. Uh, let's see. Oh, oh, yeah, that's right. Maximum supported divisions. Oh, it's under here. Oh, wait. Can we not see that? I don't know. Uh, maximum. Uh, why does that have to be over? I don't understand. Why does this have to be over here immediately? Why can't this be shifted over further left? But we've we've been doing a lot better. Like, we've been doing a lot better in this. At least I've been doing a lot better off screen. Uh, focusing just more on battleships. Like, no joke. I've got some other comments to go through. So you can see dreadnoughts. So that's a dreadnought, super big battleship basically. We got our battleships and destroyers. No carriers. Uh, some comments though. Someone asks, "Are we the good guys?" And to that, I say, if we're playing as Oswald mostly, yes. No questions asked. It doesn't matter what timeline he is, he's in, what ideology he practices. Yes, always yes, a hundred percent yes. We've killed a convoy in exchange for oh, three more convoys too, and for exchange for eleven planes for six more convoys. Not bad. Um, over here, uh, not too bad. And this time, eh, it's like some cruisers too. And I also increased the number of naval bombers we're using as well, which is actually very good. Actually, can we see how many ships Germany has? I, just, I still know they have a massive navy, but 153 is not bad. Like, this is their navy. They have one carrier left, which is really good. Uh, someone, actually, a couple of you guys said the English Channel is no place for carriers, and you're 100% correct. My fault for the last episode, even though I should have realized that carriers are really bad. Um, someone did recommend that you should have one to two battleships, or even battle cruisers, for every carrier, really. So. I guess they act more like screens, realistically. Well, screening for your carrier, because the carrier is kind of like a more false multiplier. You don't want to just use only them, because that's really, really bad. They're much better in like, in like large areas in the Atlantic, or really in the Pacific front. It is what it is, you know. Um, other than that, not much has changed. China's... We haven't actually looked at China yet. This is looking like cancer down here. Who are you, and why are you looking so ugly? Li Liang Guang's people's government versus Sichuan clique versus the Feng Shui... Oh, China is... The best way to kill off China is to let the Chinese do it. Well, the, they're, they're taking over Tibet. All right. And as you can see, well, actually, Poland capitulated already to the Germans, and now they're puppet of the Germans. I don't think that's going to last for very long, though, because the Russians are doing really, really well. The Kuban People's Republic is looking very good as well, which we like, I think. No, never mind. They're authoritarian Democrats. So wait. Wasn't there Reds here earlier? Hmm. Interesting. Anyways, we have the... Oh, Russian state's looking really big. There. The Great Caucasian State. Must be a lot of whites there. Anyways, Persia, of course. And we have the Sublime Ottoman Federation led by Abdul Masih II. Someone, uh, one of the comments from yesterday also said, someone wishes Hitler was in this mod. And yeah, go. Yeah, I had it really messed up. Yeah, from the naval warfare. But we're back. And actually, we've been doing really well. Like, I've been, I'm very, very pleasantly surprised that our tanks are actually doing very well. These guys have been attacking a lot. And we, we were the ones. We are the ones pushing through Belgium. Or, <clears throat> or Flanders Valonia in this timeline. And as you can see, we got a ton of PP. Like, we got a lot of PP here. And they just keep attacking, so I'm not really sure what to do. I I, I don't mind them, mind if they keep attacking, but... Uh, um, can you actually just go right there? I really just want to cut them off. That'd be really cool if we could. 
Look, look. Uh, is that not amazing? Like, this is one of the few times I've actually done this using tanks to go through Belgium. Uh, <laughs> Thunders Valonia, sorry. Uh, but, like, it, it's going. Like, holy cow. Also, I'll show you the casualties, too, very soon. Also, we did go to War of the Dutch. I forgot about that. My bad. Um, yeah, I think we'll go with Antwerp next. Uh, casualties. Oh, we need more fuel. We've taken 60,000 losses. Really not too bad. We've killed off... A thousand Austrians, which is fine, whatever. But really, for the Reichspact, we've killed off 400,000 just because we've been sinking convoys, which has been nuts. Actually, actually really, really cool, so. That is what it is. Um, Flanders Baloney, where is that? 32,000. I mean, look at all this. We're sinking them. And also, also like, off screen, like, like I said, I replayed it. Actually, Iceland didn't join us. They actually joined Canada. Oh. Well, that's not good. Ooh. And, but now they're, they join us again because we actually launched a naval invasion. We were actually successful, so. Very good. Just a lot of convoys getting sunk, getting stunk. Um, could you guys go right here to Antwerp? Ooh, that's pretty beefy. I don't think we can actually get in there because that is an urban center. They do have forts. We'll have to wait and see what happens. But as long as we have air superiority, we should do fairly okay. Like, And these tanks are not just light tanks. They're, they have a few milli uh, mediums in there, too, so. If not, that's okay. That's okay. Um, can you guys actually just go up to here? That'd be really beneficial. Just go up here and cut off Bruges. That'd be really nice. Actually, yeah, we might be able to. Maybe. They can pierce us somewhat. And what's wrong with this? Oh, it's low supply. That's not good. More convoys go bye-bye. And there goes the Kingdom of Ukraine, which is not good for the Germans. Because, like I said in the last episode, the Germans all have to go bye-bye. Uh, Fuel-wise... We're still trying to import more fuel. That sucks that we have to import so much. Oh, don't get me wrong. We're, oh, we did. Look at that. We won. We do need to uh, get more of this, too. Thank you. Get two more going right now. Very nice, guys. Very nice. I want two of you guys to hold, though. Everybody's gone. Cool. Victory at the home front, and then people's off the core, because we need that more army speed. Not really, but we'll do it anyways. Nice. Right, just keep them there for now. You'll be fine. These guys either will have to sink or swim in the water if they want to escape, so. Or they'll just die. Beautiful. Great. I do want to attack there next, so maybe if we can. Or we'll attack. Ooh. Tank on tank action. Well, we'll see what happens. We'll go here next. Nice. Ooh. We lost some planes, probably. Ooh, look at that lag. Oh. Well, it goes part of China. That's fine. Whatever. Cool. After that, then we'll probably do... We could use that, but... Reform the militias would be nice. If you want to go that, please go ahead. But we're going to go dissolve the militias. The arms in the hands of the rabble have been tolerated for far too long now. While our enemies hold on to these remains of a bygone age for some reason, we know that only discipline is the way forward. Yes. Oswald will lead us into Big Daddy time. And Big Daddy, Big Brother's watching, and he only wants what is best for the revolution, my friends. No, what, no matter what anyone else says or asks, he only wants best for the revolution. So we must blindly... Listen and follow everything he says. Now, I do want to make these guys 40 combo with, realistically. Um, actually, I should not, should not throw that on there. Well, we'll, we'll, we'll take off the anti-air later on, because I do want to throw in logistics, because we're going to need that. In the meantime, though, uh, I don't want to cut these guys off. Like, I want to make 40 combo with now, but we don't have the army XP for it. As well as we don't have the supply for it yet. Uh, yeah, we really don't. If that's okay, case, just get some more medium tanks in there, then. Do we have enough mediums? No, we don't. Okay, go back to lights. We still wouldn't have enough. Yeah, we changed two. Yeah, we won't have enough, so. White Ruthenia's gone. Uh-oh, the Russians are knocking. Germany, what are you going to do? Ooh, that is not good. They do have 14 divisions in there, so what do you expect? We're still somewhat winning, though, so that's actually... Wow, look at all this. If you don't lose your navy, we'll do okay. English Channel. Oh, yeah, and I guess, yeah, Italy's actually, our, the SRI is doing quite well, even though they got naval invaded in a lot of places. Uh, Italy, English Channel, just convoys, planes, stuff like that. We're doing a lot better this camp this time around, so, as you can tell. Uh, one, two, some. Nice, nice, nice. And radar does help as well. And get more radar so we can get some more discovery around here. What's going on here? Oh, you're not doing anything. That's fine. Uh, the General Raymond Briggs is doing quite well. He's really good on attack, too. He's learning how to become an organizer. Ah, very good. Oh, they're attacking southern France, so be it. And I do want to concentrate our attacks here, but 
I don't know. Italy's Italian. Usually. Usually. Yeah, but overall, we're doing better. We're doing a lot better. Sometimes I just gotta take a refresher, take a little bit of a break. Uh, redo things maybe a little bit so we don't... Or at least I don't fail as hard. You see my fails. So, and that's why cause sometimes I like leave in like when I, when I fail really hard. Show you like, you know, I'm not perfect. And I'm still learning the game, I guess, technically after three years, apparently. Apparently? Oh, apparently. Oh. Can we get Brussels next? That'd be kind of nice. Brussels, please. Um, Taki Senpai, where do you live? Give us some time and we'll attack Brussels if we possibly, possibly can. Of course, we don't have that much fuel. We got eh, 32 days. You know, it's all filled up. Naval bombers, of course, the naval bombers, like, they go on crazy in there, which we love, 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 love. Throw these guys over here. I'm going to throw these guys on the tanks, because, like I said, in the first episode, I want to use a lot of tanks. Look at these naval bombers. We got extra naval bombers. That's really awesome. More of y'all. Actually, you know what? I'm going to send you guys down south. Let's pull you guys first, and let me get some more. Uh, Enter World Bombers, there you go. You guys do that. That'd be good. And then you guys, you come down to here and see what type of magic you can cook up. Or go right here. There you go. Nice. Oh, look at that. Oh, we lost something. Some convoys. Allied convoys. That's not awesome. whatever. Um, tankies, how you doing? Can you actually go to Brussels? That'd be really cool if we could. I kind of doubt we can, realistically. I'd love to come to Middlebug, but that'd be really hard to take out right now. You really need Marines for that. Ooh, they can actually pierce us from here. No, that's not good. We're slowly winning, though. He's definitely earning his keep. Four more allies. Ooh, that's not good. Um, 29. Please don't lose. Please don't lose. If our allies could help attack, that'd be great, but I don't think they're doing anything right now. Four point some damage. Not. Oh, actually. Let's use a Cypher now that we've got it. Might as well, right? Since we're here, thank you. 30, yeah. Helps out with a breakthrough. Yes, very good. Uh, he's almost an org... Is he an organizer? He is an organizer now. Great. Good job, Raymond. Good job. Bell Alexander, what do you have for us? Nothing. Um, reinforce rate or reorganization. I think I want to wait, maybe. That stuff is not bad to use, but I think it's ultimately wait. Yeah, I've just been using tanks. Being very concentrated with our forces. That's not too bad, either. Fighter of Edit Initiative. Um, like, we've got a lot of air XP, like, as you can see. It's really good right now. Uh, you guys, head on over here. Train. You guys are help guarding the aisles for now, and we can do that. This will be really fast. I uh, do it, too, because you can. Why not? Yeah. More divisions? Good. Let's cut them down by one or two more. Oh, like, manpower-wise, we're doing great. Of course, I do want to make you guys 40 combo with, but that'll take some time. We're still struggling down here, but that's fine. That's fine. 75% trickster. Great. Now we're losing over here. I mean, well, the Russians doing quite well. They even took Mimelo already, so which is really nice. We're still slowly trying to win in here. Slowly, slowly, slowly. And we made another destroyer. Nice. Great excavation. Grab the next one excavation. It is for 1941. And get some more up at first. That'd be good. Motorized is fine to expand that. Tanks are looking definitely okay. And I've been doing a lot of naval adoption stuff too, so. Like... <laughs> I've learned my lesson. I've we've learned. I've definitely learned that lesson last time. Oh boy! All right, let's get some millies in here too. We're gonna need more. Buy more fuel. Um, we just need more. I want more tanks. That's really all it is. When in doubt, get more tanks. When in doubt, you guys go home. Stop costing me so much fuel right now. Oh, this is so painful looking at this. Oh, there's really nowhere else really good to attack. I guess technically we could try to naval invasion since we do have naval superiority. We could probably launch into Rotterdam, even though using tanks to invade is really, 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 really bad idea. Yeah, um, he's he's earning his keep. Jesus Christ. Oh, this place not good to attack with such so many divisions down there. Oh, hello. Look at the training center. That's fine. Cool. Hey, spy promoted. I'd love to invade here, but we don't. Obviously, we don't have naval superiority there. This is really disappointing. People's officer corps and dissolve the militias. Followed up with. Women soldiers know. Adopt new doctrines. Let's get that line doctrine done quickly. Now that the military order has been changed, we need to optimize the organization of logistics, like messages, and orders. All that small, boring stuff that win wars. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, as I pop my back. Alright, so let's get one of you guys rolling. You are down there. Um, actually, I'll sacrifice these guys. Stop training for now. Well then. Let's go from here. Go to there. We're going to get hit pretty hard doing this. 
Um, go there too. Yeah, ooh, we launch s strikes here, all across here. We might actually be able to get something. Go from here to there. Dover to here, and then from here as well to there. Only 10 divisions to do this, which is actually really bad. Ooh, we need more convoys too. That is not ideal. This one's almost done, which is nice. Go up to three for now. That would be fine. That would be fine. I'm sure how many ships are repairing. Four. That's not bad. Um, there you go. Serbia. Okay, then Serbia. Whatever. That sucks. More combos go bye-bye, huh? And these guys are still raging on. Actually, how? Actually. Not bad. Over here, the federal government has already collapsed. The Southern Republic still exists. And these guys are just killing each other. So it's very weird over there. Very weird. Oh, well, it is what it is. Nope, don't care about that. Don't care about that. Public recognition, don't really care either. So, sorry. Don't really care right now. All right, Romania, you're doing your stuff. If you attack the Russians, I'll be happy with that. Looking pretty good around here. You know, they're losing Sicily, which sucks. But whatever. I, I, I want to attack. I really do. But attacking here is just really bad. Probably. Probably just incredibly bad. Air superiority-wise, we're actually doing okay. 74, I mean, I think it's going to go up. I mean, it's probably going to drop. I mean, honestly, it's, we're just using infantry here, so that's why I'm not attacking down there. Um, other than that, not much else is going on. As you can tell, we're doing that one right there. Ah, more tanks, nice. Um, yeah, I think the next step, we got to get that naval invasion stuff. Oh, oh, that's easy and optimal capture, nice. Hey, look at that, great. The fight for Brussels is taking quite a long time, which makes sense. Let's go in. Cool. All right, one, two, some, and some more. Good. Good. Uh, how are we doing the tanks? Doing a little better. Doing a little better. 61 now. That's very nice. Very nice. Good. We will get Brussels. The tanks are rolling in. The tanks are rolling in. They're going to throw in more guys in here, too, but that's okay. As soon as the next one is done, we're going to rotate them out and rotate them in. All right, they keep throwing more guys, and that's fine. Losses 87,000. We've been doing pretty darn well. What's the manpower like for these guys, actually? They have one ship left. Very good. 22,000 manpower. Germany has less than a million. And Russia's got 20... Oh, my goodness. That's not good. Then again, they're... Oh, that's not good. Max Butler has been captured. I'm glad we got maintenance companies. And Grenfell is really, really experienced. We'll use her. And naval invasion stuff. Uh, where is it? Ah, here it is. Landing craft. Good. Hey, look at, oh, look at this. Carriers. So we lost two destroyers, but we sunk two destroyers and more planes. That's not too bad. Not great, but not bad. H oh, oh, T.E. Lawrence was killed. Oh, no. A hero was called to his final rest. No. T.E. Lawrence, no. You have been murdered. That is so unfortunate. You guys are still fighting for this. We are doing so well there earlier. We're not really losing too badly, so. Um, I do want to lower my reliance on these guys, so. That'd be good. Really drop them. Alright, alright. More convoys sunk, good. And more convoys, of course, sunk, which is very good as well. This guy's really going to become an urban assault specialist. I don't want to launch an invasion until we're done here, too, so. Uh, we should be getting close to dissolving the militias, which is nice, and it's going to take a while to get more research done, huh? They're attacking through here. The Germans really... Guys, please concentrate your forces a little bit better than this. I think we're doing pretty well with concentrating our forces. How's Russia... Oh, ho! Oh, Russia! Uh, naval invaded! Look at... They re they invaded behind Copenhagen! Oh, boy! Now, that's pretty nice. Oh, Königsberg is almost a frontline city as well. The Eastern Front is still holding steady. Of course, holding very, very steady. Rome is a holdout. I think they naval invaded for that area, too. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Not bad. Not bad. Any spare ships yet? No. That's unfortunate. Anything else here? No. He's doing okay. He's really good at fleet coordination, though. And y'all... Well... Norman's doing pretty darn well, I'd say. Still 10 out of 10. We're still fighting for Brussels. This is taking forever. Go and get some more organization first before throwing back in the fight. Slowly they get more manpower. They've up to 200 divisions, which is not bad. Um, ah, screw do that, why not? You can do both. i got nothing else to do with the PP right now, so. Uh, we could lower that, but I don't really feel like it. 
Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, just allied convoys, that's fine. I don't care. We're still trying to fight. How much longer is this one going to take? Three months. Jesus Christ, it's so long. Fight for Brussels. This is taking so long. There's nowhere really else we can... Oh, hold on. Hold the phone. This might be a really dumb idea. We could try it. Alright, let's come over here, too. Make these guys a little, a little bit more armored. We do have enough tanks for that, so that's nice. Wait. T.E. Lawrence died, but he fell ill. Okay. Makes perfect sense. Perfect sense. Um, That's looking not too bad. Oh, look at that. Oh, the ships. We need more dockyards. Oh boy, oh boy, what's going on? What's going on here? Convoy. Um, ooh. We lost three. We sunk two. We dissolved the militias. We're adopting a new doctrine as well. Uh, that's considered a victory? Okay, we lost... They lost a lot more than us, which is good to see, but still. Um, just in case. Just in case. Get a hundred extra fighters around here. And... Ooh, yes. Get two more of these guys going. There you go. That should help us out, no matter where we're at. Cool. Oh, look at that. We actually sunk a destroyer doing that. Nice. Uh, where are you guys at? Can you guys actually win there? Can you force the attack? Can you actually force the attacking? Oh, we need a few more days for that one. Ooh, they might actually be able to win there. Maybe? Yes? No? They might just be able to break over the water. They are. Oh. 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 Russia is going crazy with naval invasions. You think anybody but Russia would be doing naval invasions for some reason, but okay. Winston Madden? Yeah, why not? If we can slither on in, I'd be happy, man. I'll be happy. Come on, 94, 95. Let's go in, boys. Y'all got this? Oh, crap. That's not good. Oh, man. That's really bad. Oh, my goodness. My bad. My bad. Oh, we're losing them. We're losing them. Oh, <laughs> I make mistakes. Oh, we did win up down here, which is nice. Good job, guys. Um, So, yeah, my bad. I make mistakes. <laughs> As you can see, I make a lot of mistakes sometimes. Oh, please don't sink all the convoys. Seven guys, get your butts over here. Oh, don't lose them all. That sucks. Well, no matter what I do, I end up losing things. Eight. Not bad. All right, we landed. Yep, time to go ham. Excuse me, game. Please, you can see how bad it's lagging right now. Let's go. Alright, so I got another ship. We got more millies, nice. Get a little bit more of that. We're gonna need way more support equipment where we're headed to. Uh, get some more of that too. We're starting to run out of things as well, which sucks. But... Okay, the Dutch are gone! The failure of the Dutch government to protect their own isles. Oh, the Russians are doing great. We might just have the breakthrough we need and want right now. Um, I might send my tanks up here. I might literally just send them up here. Good. Convoys go bye-bye. Good, good, good. Head on in, boys. Y'all doing a great job. Nice. Naval torpedo strikes are very good. Grab this one, too. That'd be nice. Ace pilot promoted. Very nice. Oh, they're attacking us. We're actually attacking them right here, too. I don't think we can do that well. How many divisions are we fighting? Just 20. That's all. Just casually just 20 divisions. Um, I'm going to send you guys up. Screw it. Hold. Come up here. It's Dutch time, baby. I think the Germans are going to capitulate very soon. I have a good feeling they're going to capitulate. Because unless I can address this front against the Russians, they're dead. They're holding over here, but everywhere else. No, no, no. Go, boys. I know you only have infantry, or you have no artillery, really. You have support artillery, that's it. Which I should have given you more, but whatever. Whatever. 
And you have no air superiority, my bad. My bad! You really need to get better bombers. You could probably use that. Go, go, go. Please, don't get sunk. For the love of God. Yeah, sink that. Our allies' stuff, not us. Yeah, there you go. Nice. Go, go, go! Screw this one. Screw the Low Countries, man. I prefer Germany proper. Nice. Oh, we love the Russians for now until we have to fight them to ourselves. Go, go, go. Gods, what the heck are you doing? Tanks. Seriously, tanks. Babies. Come on, babies. Let's go. Let's go. Nice. The enemy subs are gone. Oh, the G Russians are approaching Berlin, baby. Oh, they actually took back Mumelan over there. Look at that. Ah, this is looking beautiful. Dortmund will be ours very soon. The Fall of Berlin. Ha! We've killed off 600... No, they, the Russians killed 600. We've done four, almost half a million. We've only taken 141,000 losses. The fight against the Russians is going to be terrible, though. That's going to be god-awful. I can already tell. Hey, we were in a division. Look at that. Nice. If the Russians keep it up, we can keep it up, too. Well, for now. I mean, the green is nice, but still. Actually, where are the airfields? We need more airfields. Build them up, boys. Wait, we're fighting. Who are we? What? Oh, we need more fuel. Uh, we got these guys coming along. We need more tactical bombers, too. Oh, wow. Uh, at this point, let's just do this one. Limited exports. There you go. That should help us out a little bit more. Oh. Uh, United Mexican States. There you go, that should really help us out a little bit more. Uh-oh. I have three subs, whatever. Go, go, go. Oh, they're bending the line over here too, maybe? Yes? Oh, we can pair glider planes. That's kind of cool. Maybe you guys can do something over here. That'd be really good. Oh, an encirclement. Oh, that's so bad for them. So bad for them. Too bad we're killing them off. Hmm. We this have for the German uh for the Flan Flemish. Flemish Valonia. Who needs to go through when you can go around? Alright, learn everything you can about Germany, boys. I know it's over river, boys. That's gonna be real bad for us, but that's alright. We'll do it. We'll do it. Okay, buy a lot of fuel back now. We need a lot more fuel. One two is not bad. Feels looking a lot better. Not bad, not bad. We are pushing down almost scarily too fast down here. Or incorrectly, realistically. Ah, uh, Leipzig is a capital now. Very good, very good. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, they're... Oh, we've sent a living... Oh, boy. Oh, yes, yeah, sink them, baby. Sink them. Sink them. More subs. Nice. I'm going plane. That's fine. Cool. Go, go, go. Master sh needs to be ours. Anything else here? Uh, sure. War of Agenda, that's fine. Go in here. I can't imagine the Germans having too much more... A lot of manpower. Supply-wise, they are running out of... Oh, there's no infantry equipment left. Just like got some fuel. We got a lot of equipment going. Like, we're good. We do not have fuel, that's all. Hello. Well, that's not good. Now we got our planes in the air and some land-based uh, naval bombers blowing each other up here. Come on, guys. Don't suck it up. Don't let them escape. Come on. Don't don't let them escape. Come on, guys. Jesus Christ. Why are you so dumb? <sighs> so dumb. But now that we know that they really love that spot, here's more, tact more naval bombers. But you need to get na better naval bombers. Oh, CSA. Uh, 
Uh, we don't need that much right now because we're not we're repairing a lot of ships, which makes a lot of sense. Oh, wait, how many? 14? 14 still has fine. Wow. Oh, we've almost gotten all the way up there. Okay, so after we adopt new doctrines, total mobilization will be nice. For the cooperation, the red. I need motorized research. Well, tanks are good and all, and so it's all somehow. It seems that they become even more useful when their infantry can actually keep up with them. Maybe we should investigate this circumstance. I'll just cut them off in one of these two areas. Just one of these two areas. Then these guys will all fall apart. That's a dream, man. That's a dream. An extraordinary congress of the trade unions? We've almost driven the Kaiser and his reactionaries from Europe. Now is the perfect time for a congress of the trade unions to be called to rebuild our entire nation. Now is the perfect time to reorganize a government. Happy 41, everyone. Keep doing a land doctrine. Thank you very much. That'll help us out. Yes. Ah. So close, man. We're so close. I know our guys need a break, but still. And this is really not good, too, but still. Russians, keep pushing, keep pushing. They're actually pushing back out, it looks like, maybe. Oh, we cut him off. We cut him off. Actually, the French got in there, and that's really nice. Don't give up the attacks. Good. At this point, you guys keep going. You guys stop. I need you guys to hold. I need you guys to stop as well. Because I want you guys to finish this area off. Get up there. Finish it, pocket off, and then come back in. Oh, I can't wait for the peace deal. Uh, good, 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 good. Even though it'll probably be better to take out those guys, but whatever. Hey, some ships, nice. What's going on here in the English Channel? Hawaiian Ridge, Central America. Oh, yeah, Central America's doing stuff, nice. Iceland? Oh, that's looking not great. Po Valley, huh? Wow. Okay, these guys are really pushing hard now. Good. And where are you guys at? Are you still doing some good stuff here, guys? Give them a little, few more days first. I don't want to attack you up. And they're not attacking us here too much, too, so... Actually, you guys can attack here, too. That's fine. I like to attack here, but whatever. Um, Ronald, you've done a great job so far. Uh, losses are, what, 200,000? Quarter million? Makes sense. Makes sense. I sorry. I sorry. I'm sorry. This thing. Well, I just want to make sure we're, we'll do okay. Hey, they finally give up. Oh, going boys, going. No mercy. Let the tanks roll, baby. Landing craft. Good. We really didn't need that for that time, but whatever. Get some better fighters now, and get some better ships, get our planes, stuff like that. So. Denmark. Goodbye. Go in. Go in. Support your tanks. Five research slots. So good. Uh, for now, do the Russian state. Aluminum. Come to France. Yes, please. Good. That's fine. I'll make our own rubber, too. Ah, look at all those divisions in there. Oh, my goodness. That's so nice. How many divisions are stuck in there? Well, these guys are attacking. Trying to attack out. Uh, only 29, at least. So, goodbye, 29 divisions. You've chosen poorly. Goodbye, capitalists and reactionaries. Overwhelming numbers. Good, because now we're doing this. And then you guys come right here. And we'll get ready for the great push. The last great push of the war. Because the Germans are tired. They're done. They're completely done. Ah, very nice. Nice glasses, mister, mister. Silesia. It's very disappointing that these guys weren't pushing on here. I guess it makes sense that they actually navy invaded, which gives them a lot more support, but still. Ah, uh, good. Uh-oh. Seven more convoys go bye-bye. Thank you very much. And actually, after this next motorized research, I think we'll do... Eh, that sounds okay. Fast battleships with Dreadnought effort. Dreadnoughts are the kings of the sea and were key to the global dominance of the British Royal Navy the prior to the Valkyrie. If we are to ever regain our naval strength, we must have new battleships. Absolutely. My friends, are you ready to unleash a hellacious torrent of metal and lead? Yes. Go ahead. Get your planes in the air, too. Immediate planage. Um, yeah, doesn't look like you guys got that much there. You guys should be doing okay-ish around here. Oh, you're not even... You're not even doing anything. 
Seriously, why are you guys not doing anything? I gave you orders. I'm pretty sure I did. Maybe I'm wrong about that. We're going anyways. Alright, not bad. I like to keep doing this stuff. So we're going to. And we'll do some air duction as well. Wrong group. There you go. Nice. Yep, Germany, there's a massive hole in the line there. Very good, very good. Oh, yes. They love they love attacking here. They just love it so much. Go, the subs are distractions. Use those naval bombers, baby. Oh, look how weak they're getting. Oh, it's so nice. Oh, those poor marines. Oh, well. Convoys, destroyers, nice. Because next up, will probably be Russia and then Canada, perhaps. Hey! An encirclement! Go, go, go. Push them harder, push them harder. Another division? Jolly good. All right. 1.3. I do want to use more heavy medium tanks, I should say. Oh, we can get some better medium tanks this year as well. Can we do that as well? Yes, we can. Nice. Ah, oh, the fall of the German Empire. Now, to try to divide this up between us and everyone else. Going to be a little messy, not going to lie. Going to be a little messy, so. Even the SRI is still struggling down here, which is fine. Happens. Ah, good. Not bad, not bad. And that collapse of the Reich's Pact, which is very good. Now it's going to lag extremely hard, which is unfortunate. Uh, hmm, I could fade and fade out right now and do the peace deal, but then again, we might not need, might not need to. Well, here comes the peace deal. You know what, I think I'll do this off-screen and I'll see you in just a little bit. Alright everyone, so here's the peace deal. Um, I gave Russia a good chunk of all this stuff just because I thought they deserved it. Obviously, I took the Dutch, you know, Netherlands for now, and Northwest Germany. I gave France, Southern Germany, and part of the, basically the Rhineland, and gave, oh, I guess Belgium. Oh, the Belgian Syndicate Republic is here. Look at that. Oh, they already re released. Oh, good job, France. You guys are actually really fast. So the fall of Germany, the end of an era, of course. And now it's time to push in and just destroy the Austro-Hungarians, who, of course, were guaranteeing the Italians. Who are probably more than likely going to die in this episode as well. As... Oh. Oh. That's so sad. Why does Luxembourg have to exist? I'm sorry, Charles Marx and Luxembourgish people. Which I doubt. If you're from Luxembourg watching this video, please let me know. Please let me know. Because I don't want to insult you too much. But just like... Bro, just just unite with the rest of the Benelux. Like, just make one big country. The borders look so much nicer. And, uh... Oh, South German... Oh, Kurt Eisen Huh. Oh, Alright, well, whatever. And probably the Rhineland's going to come out. Rhenish... Or not. Oh! This is not bueno. No, 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 no. There you go. There you go, though. There you go. I just want to push into the uh, Sudetenland, just because I won't get through the mountains. Also, I did get Japan all the, Ital the Italian stuff? No. The German colonial stuff. Wow! The Republic of China is here. Look at that. Zhang Zulin. I need to play China again sometime. And Kaiser Rikux, Kaiser Reich. I gave the Dutch East Indies to the Japanese. Everything, Anything that was Asian, I gave it to the Japanese, so. I don't want to deal with it. I definitely, definitely, definitely do not want to deal with it, so. Um, you guys, it's almost done. That's fine. Do that one. Ground attack initiative. Just keep spending that air XP. I mean, just, we got so much of it. I don't think that these guys are really expecting us to demolish them like this, so. But that's okay with us. Because I want a big old say in Austria-Hungary. We'll see what happens. I'll divide this up, of course, fairly, relatively fairly with the Russians, so. Um, yeah, it shouldn't be too bad. And we'll do the peace deal once this war in Europe is done. Because then we get to focus. Actually, can we just... Can, can we invite you in? Just let's invite you in. Can I go to war with these guys? Seriously. Actually, you know who we want to go to war with? The Irish. That's right. Come out, you black and tans. It's fine. Motorized research. Do not effort. Very good. Cool. Ah, oh wait. Someone capitulated there. Entente. We got to get to Canada and the French national state. And Istanbul back. And Bohemia is gone, which is awesome, awesome, awesome. You guys are aware. Uh, there you go. Keep going in, guys. You're doing a great job. Well, once we get Milan, they'll be all good and done, so. Oh, very good. Very good. How many more days? 42 days. That's pretty good. We shall never surrender, pretty much. Oh, okay. Never surrender. That's really nice. Give us a couple days to do the Rhineland and the Dutch. Kind of like them under us, though. Hmm. Ah, there goes Austrians. Nice job, guys. Alright, so I'll start off with what probably we know the best. Seven call if you get this, 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 this. Uh, we're not going to give anything to those pesky Romanian boys. No, no, no. 
I'll give it to those to those guys, but we'll also give Russia. Let's give them Hungary. Let's be nice. You can have Hungary. That's it. You get nothing else. Um, the Poles. Where are the Poles? We like Poles. Oh, Danish state looks really nice. Oh, there's Prussia. Oh, they must have been released. Polish state? They must be independent and not doing anything. Finland. Uh, yeah, I don't see them. Well. There you go. We'll take these guys. France can have Greece. Um, I think I want to take Austria, and I'll give this to France. Because I don't want to divide up the land, so g give them Illyria. We'll take Austria. There you go. This looks so ugly. This looks so god-awfully ugly. I mean, I should not... Yeah, I should not have given them... Hung I, I should not have given them this. I really shouldn't have given them hung Hungary. Oh, that's a bit too much. Uh... It's a bit too much, yeah, realistically. They didn't do it that, that much at all. And again, all we can do is us. Eh, whatever. Well, if there's another peace deal, we'll take whatever we want from them then. Um, where do I send you guys then? This side? Ooh, where do we send you guys now then? Serbia? Maybe? I don't know. Where do you send you guys? Sarajevo? That'd be kind of nice. Actually, we took, did take them out. Uh, in the meantime, go and start making another one of... I don't like that one. Come here for Dreadnoughts, maybe, perhaps? Go to five, perhaps? That could work. A little bit of lag is fine. Oh, there goes Hungry. They've been released. All right. Uh, war propaganda against these guys. That's fine. Malta, of course. Oh, wow. That's getting smaller and smaller and smaller. Go in, boys. Go in. Don't give up the fight until they're all dead. And now we're no longer fighting just over the river. A literal land-based connection. Get some resource efficiency gain. That would be really good. Take, take Milan. You've got to take Milan. Please take Milan. Look at all that lag. Oh, baby boy. Nice. And anyone else? Romania? Hungary got a little bit more. L guys. Oh my god, this is disgusting. Why did you release all these guys independently? Oh, the pirates are back though. That makes literally no sense. I don't I hate that so much. Um that's okay, so we're going back home. Sorry guys, we're going back home now. Hey, look at that. Not bad. Task force destroyed. All right, call about day for Eric Blair. Comrade Eric Blair, once an ally of the Grand Protector Mosley, cannot stand any longer. For too long, the evil Mosley has perverted the Constitution and made the Union of Britain his plaything. A popular rider and skilled militia commander, Blair alone has the, uh, has the authority to bring down the tyrant. As Blair stared out into the rainy day, he knew he had to take action. His populace grew successful. <gasps> what? He brings in the military. The Feds and Cons becomes ruling party. T. Lawrence becomes leader of the Syndicalist Party. Mosley sniffs out the coup. You will not get rid of Oswald Handsome Mosley. You will not. And the revolution looks like it's pretty much complete. Nice. Well, with that done and dusted and the Poles dying to the Russians, things are as they should be. Why did you release Galicia Little Russia, you're fell with the idiots. Why? More of that stuff because you always use more. He's more there too. Um, at this point, just do this one. We're going. Oh, light tank. Why do we get light tank destroyers? Cool. What? No. Seriously, who researched that? Motorized. Uh, someone's justifying on us, huh? That's not good. There you go. Screw it. Go there. And who's justifying on whom? Serbia. Oh, Serbia, okay. That's fine. We're okay with that. Montenegro, huh? Black Mountain. Oh, you the same guys leading both countries, huh? How about Croatia? No, someone else. Okay. Slovenia? Should have just had Yugoslavia. Oh, there goes the Polish state. Um honestly, the Russians did a lot more. I'll just give it to them, screw it.
Hmm. Yeah. We gave him a little bit too much territory, I'll be honest, but whatever. Alright. Fall of Manila. Alright. Oh, look at that. Now there's a battle going on. Central America. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's alright. Oh, there's Malta. Nice. Let's give it to them. Nice. Good job, guys. Good job. So third international is not, look, not looking too bad. Pretty good. Uh oh, that's all right. Nice, nice, nice. Another task force destroyed. Union of Iceland. We need way more tanks than hot socks. It's all right though. Oh, hello. Oh, and we don't forget about this too. Hey, the Dutch. After a short campaign across the marshes in the urban centers of the Dutch lands, we have managed to trace and track down and take down the proud nation. The Netherlands are now in our hands. We must decide on its future. Military occupation to liberate the Netherlands but explain Flanders. Huh. Liberate the Netherlands as a whole. Yeah, that's, that's what I see to do. Just give it a Flanders, huh? Um, fate of the Rhineland. It's fine. The entire Rhenish region has been brought under our control. Currently, our armed forces are facing some opposition from local populations. We can leave it up to the local governments in the region to take care of any dissidents. Rhenish state? Or at least as part of a larger North German state. Um, what about... Uh, yeah, that's fine. I want a large North German state. Nice. Fate of Austrian Venice. Oh, we do have Venice. That is true. Um, return to Slovene lands, Italian lands. Let's give it a few more days first. Sure, guys. Sure, that's fine. Ah, see, they did get this territory back. I like that a lot. I wanted to return German lands. Hanover. Yeah, there you go. Yep. The British government has been discussing what to do with the Hanoverian lands we currently occupy. Land which we have no rightful claim to. Should we return the lands? Of course not. Of course not. There you go. Because I want the biggest puppet possible. A bigger puppet, a single bigger puppet is better than, like, several smaller puppets. So we have, uh, three Germanys. We have the Prussians. We've got the South German Union and the Union of Hanover, so... Hanover got a lot out of this peace deal. And return Italian lands, yes. Yes. Wait, is that it? Is that all you wanted? What the heck? Um, sure, you guys, that's Slovene lands. Uh, well, I'll see. Austria. Uh, Venice. Oh, they should not... Oh, it's gonna be so ugly. Um... Austria. Austria has been forced to capitulate and our troops are patrolling the streets of Vienna to prevent a further rebellion or anything that could cause further instability. However, some have proposed that creating a local Austrian government would be more helpful. It's fine. I should not have given them suit to roll. Oh, well, actually, it doesn't even matter. Give me another day or so. There might be more things here. Thanks about promoted. They cancel non aggression pact. Don't care. Don't care. Don't care. Fate of Venice. Um, our armies are taking control of Venice, and the locals are clamoring for self-government. We should decide to be what's done with the region, as it will be difficult to, and expensive to hold otherwise. That's fine. You can have that. Eh, not too bad. Uh, fate of Bohemia, Austrian littoral. We are taking control of the formerly Austrian territories in Istrian Gorizia, Gradiska. We must decide what to do with it. Italian lands. The Republic of Austria. Uh, Slovenia, Illyria, or military occupation. Why would it give to Illyria? Can I give it to Fiume? I would love to love to give it to Fiume. I would absolutely love to. They have a single division there. That's a lot of manpower for being a single state. Cool. Um. Honestly, if I give it to Austria, they're just going to make a really, really weak navy. So it just makes more sense to give it to Italy. It just makes more sense. And Slovenia, if they give it to them, like the exact same thing, they're going to have a really, really small military, and I don't want that. So just give it to Italian allies. There you go. Uh, Fate of Trentino. We are taking control of the formerly Austrian territory in Trentino. We must decide what to do with it. Republic of Austria? Um, it's really not much. It's really not much. It doesn't look very... This does not look very good at all. Hmm. Let me give it to Austria. Just looks a little better. I already gave this to them, so they can have this too. That makes more sense. Followed up with what? Fit of Bohemia. Italian finance has been reunited. Second resorgimento complete. Uh, yeah, Russia, yeah. Yeah, guys, yeah. Totally. Three destroyers, nice. Bohemia. Uh, the ancient hotland of the Czechs has been conquered by victorious forces. The venerable gym of the Moldau Prague is occupied by our troops who parade smartly across the Wenceslas Square. Should we probably put the Czech government loyal to their designs of their own state or maintain a splendid military occupation? I want to give them to Austria. 
Well, whatever. Check state, that's fine. Not bad, pretty good. Pretty darn good. Uh, Supermarine Spitfire, very good. Uh, we have to do that one too, so be it. Um, oh, we don't have enough millies now. That's not good. So, I'm going to wait for those guys down there. Honestly, that's not too bad. Um, oh, Transylvania exists too. Look at that. Wow, that is very weird to have right there. That is very odd. Eventually, we'll probably have to go to war with these guys anyways, but we'll see what happens. Overall, not too bad. What's the next thing we're going to do? Dreadnought effort? Fast battleships? Yeah. Probably fast battleships. Yeah. Well, lacking the armor of a Dreadnought, fast battleships are agile and pack a versatile suit of heavy guns. An evolution of the battlecruisers of World War I who served effectively during the Valkyrie and expansion of our fast battleship fleets is essential to the reconstruction of the British Navy. Absolutely. Uh, we'll go modern Blitzkrieg. we got more than enough manpower for now. Is it still only to Serbia or is Russia doing it? No, it's Serbia. That's good. Kingdom of Canada, huh? Well, I won't, I won't invade Ireland next. Realistically, it's probably the best way to invade them. Alright, so you guys are fine. You're, you're, you're home. You're doing a great job. We'll just go from here to Belfast. And you guys go from here to there. You guys are also going to invade right there. And also go to Derry as well. You can't get quite to Derry, that's fine. Because I want to keep going one, two, three. As well, go right there, it's fine. And we need time to set this up anyway, so it's fine. Derbyshire or something like that? Alright. Go right there. A full invasion of these guys. Who are we still fighting? Oh, it's still the Entente. It's just the entire Entente. It's fine. If we don't have to fight the Russians, I'll be happy about that. I hope these guys do attack us, though. Let's see how, how long is it? Oh, it's going to take a long time. That's fine. Um, the tank's looking really bad, but that makes sense. That's going to be so much lag. It's an ungodly amount of lag. Hey, two ships. Not bad. It's going to cost more fuel, but that's okay. And you guys are looking pretty good, too. Not bad. So you have, so you're harder to find. Nice. And do that, too. There you go. Expand out a little bit more, as well. You find enemy fleets, you kill them. Nice. Ethiopia and Somalia. This... Oh, hello. Um, I'd love to send some guys down through here. Oh, there goes that, and that sucks. You can do stuff like that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm going to strain for now, and we'll do the fast battleship effort. Not bad, not bad. Sure, guys, it's fine. So, we got to invade North Africa, and then invade... Oh, look at that, nice. Look at that. Um, North America. That's going to kind of suck, but that's alright. We've killed off almost none of them. Hey, almost 200,000 Canadians, though. Never mind. Never mind. Oh, no, time to panic. Okay, we're panicking now. Well, then. Race in Russia and race in Russia. Uh, you guys will be fine, actually. Oh, that's not good. Hey, another test force. Nice. Floating airfield's good. We're gonna keep going this way. Like, I want to make sure our, our naval doctrine is perfect. We have to, basically. Oh, look at that. Nice. Nice. It's 41, and the American Civil War is still raging on, huh? Jesus Christ, guys. Here we long. Why are you taking so long? Nice flag, though. That's a really nice flag. Uh oh. And yeah, some allied stuff. That's fine.
Well, they're in there, so let us go. Come on. They joined the Entente. Why are they not fighting us yet? Demand Bessarabia back. Alright. That's gonna kinda suck. Oof. Hey, not bad. Not bad. Come on, come on, come on, Russia. Join the warfare, god dang it. Come on, join, 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 join. Assert a position. H no! You made me stop. You know what? Hmm. Let's go. We'll invade. I don't know these guys. Guys, we should have. We should be getting re good to get ready to go to invade. Actually, not Belfast, I guess. Wait, actually, don't do it right there. What am I doing? From here to there. From here to there. Here to there. This is everybody. Go ahead, guys. I know we are missing a lot of tanks. It goes Hawaii, unfortunately. Another dread, not bad. Not bad. The Sea Wolf. Um, I'll do Consumer Expert. Come on. You join the Entente. Let us go. Look at all these guys that join the Entente. That's insane. Can someone please go to war with them? Please, let us just go kill them off. All right, Spitfires are nice. Get some of those guys too. Uh oh. Oh, Fiume's gone. No. Oh. There we go. Here we go. They've been called in finally. Let's go. Oh, god dang it. Just. Why can't we go to war with them? I don't care. We have an aggression pact. I don't care. No attrition bombing. It's fine. Call them in, call them in, come on. Come on, let's go. I don't understand why. We have a non-aggression pack? Yeah, I don't think so. There we go, go in, go in, go in, go in, go in. Force it. Oh, you still have you up here. What are you doing up here? Yeah, they have some sort of invisible line right there, which is very weird, but okay. Well, none of you guys are down here now. That sucks. Okay, how much longer do we have to wait to go to war with these guys? That's not bad. Less than two weeks, that's pretty good. Ooh, we lost three subs. That sucks. Or sunk three enemy subs or something like that. That's not bad. How strong is Russia? I kind of figured they would do this. Two oh, that's a lot of manpower. That's a lot of divisions. That's a lot of dudes. Hopefully we'll do okay, though. It's fine. Uh, for now, make some more radar up here, too. That'd be very beneficial. That'd be good, good, good. Overall, our allies are doing okay. It's definitely a mixed bag. They, they already made it in Sigma, though, which is kind of impressive, not going to lie. That is a little impressive already. And they're pushing in through Prussia a little bit, so... Not bad. Obviously, it'd be better if we were actually invading with them, but whatever. We are ready to go, 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 grow... Oh, we got plenty of fighters. Look at that. Three. A riddle, huh? Nice. Our railway syndicates have a tradition of giving out a ridiculously, cro ridiculously difficult crossword puzzle in the newspapers. Only a few people actually manage to solve these puzzles. Now, however, Mid-England Rail Syndicate has reported that for the past few months, anonymous letters have started arriving, always containing the correct solutions to the last crossword puzzle. Whoever's writing these letters must be some sort of genius and could probably be of help to you. Who, who, why do I care? Find that person? Yes. That's cool. Hopefully we do well here. Using tanks is probably a really bad idea. Are you not invading or something here? What's going on? You should, with, with two militia divisions, you should easily be able to win here. Take one of you guys to go there and take the other two. Why is it lagging so hard? Holy crap! It's paused! <laughs> Something I don't really understand. How does it lag that hard if it's paused? Game? What the heck game? Ooh, I should have done this a lot longer ago. It's alright though. You can double time it.
Now we're gonna need a lot more fuel. Oh boy. Oh boy. Um How about just a little bit more? Come on, you guys gotta win. There's they're militia for the god's sakes. How are you not winning against flippin' militia? Oh, they're going to war with the Japanese... Huh, okay. Alright, well, they're going to town on those guys, too. Let's get some better tanks. Thank you. They must be doing force defense. Especially when we have air superiority. Come on. Just keep going, guys. Keep going. Don't give up. Don't give up. I, I don't understand this. I literally don't understand this. Like, I get invading with tanks is really bad, but at the same time, it shouldn't even flip a matter like this. It, they're militia. They have literally nothing but just guys with guns. Stopping tank divisions from landing? Yeah, I'm sorry, man, but that's BS. That's 100% BS. We have air superiority and intel advantage. He's got six attack. These guys have two. <laughs> attack. Oh my god, come on. Alright, fast battleship efforts. Follow it up with Republican Marines, expand the dockyards. With the Merchant Marine Service established and all Union operated ships firmly integrated, our nation's ports are becoming increasingly congested. With the problem projected to only get worse, we must immediately expand the most clogged ports. Yeah, I don't understand this one, one single bit. Are you guys going to go or not? Why are you even over here then if you're not going to go? What the hell is wrong with this thing? We should be able to win here, but. What a waste of space. These. These infantry divisions are. Holy crap, they're pathetically bad. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're, we're gonna go. Nope, that was deemed to be a lie. Nice, keep sinking their stuff, keep sinking them. How much do we need? 16 and a half. Well, we're getting up there somewhat. 90's not bad. Well, this is stupid. This is incredibly stupid. They're guys with guns. Just run them over, for the love of God. But I think I've got to end the episode here. In which I've got to re redo this, because this is stupid. That's incredibly stupid. But if you enjoyed the video, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow, when we will push all the way into Moscow. Thanks for watching. Have a great, great rest of your day.